Hello friends, my name is Coolio and welcome back to the channel. Guys, it's like really early in the morning for me, so I apologize. I'm like absolutely exhausted right now, but I gotta get another video out for you guys because I went over to the subreddit and already Dragali Loss is being data mined like crazy. So I've gone ahead, copied some of the pictures over for you guys, and we're gonna talk about some of these things real quick and just have like a pretty simple video today and just kind of talk about some of the cool stuff that um, people have kind of shared so far on the Reddit forums. Now, uh, a lot of the stuff is still hasn't been fully translated yet, so I don't know exactly everything. Um, but the first thing we're going to talk about is there's a whole bunch of new heroes that have just been data mined that look absolutely amazing. These guys look just insanely cool. Like, I am so excited to unlock some of these characters. So I'll have them kind of going up across the screen for you guys, as well as we've got um, two new dragons too, so keep an eye out for them. Uh, it's going to be like this ice diamond dragon and this little girl dragon with these bat wings which is awesome she's not a hero she's an actual dragon so you'll see them uh come up across the screen as well um i'll have those kind of popping up for you guys um uh, during the video so you can just see them uh the other things i want to talk about is um there are some tutorial um hints that they finally kind of taken images of uh for example uh increasing your bond with your dragon they, they showed a video on that um, one thing is, and what which is interesting, is it doesn't actually increase the stats of your dragon, but you can unlock the dragon's history and their lore through their dragon stories. You unlock special items, which we don't really know what they are just yet, and it extends their shape-shifting time. Along with that is if you combine a dragon and a hero of the same elemental type, you actually get a uh, activated special abilities. Um, on top of that is you can um, increase your your characters as well to unlock like you can give your characters it looks like you can give your characters items or you can increase your bond with your characters in some way to unlock stories through the through the castle system through castle stories to know more about the characters daily lives it also talks about different they look like dragon orbs that you can collect to unlock dragons um, I'm not entirely sure what this is. If anyone knows for sure what it is, let me know down in the comments. But it leads me to believe that the very first event that we're going to have in the game is called Loyalty's Requiem, and we're going to get a free five-star dragon. And from the image itself, it looks amazing. So I love the story. I'm so excited. I'm glad that the game's giving us an option that we can actually jump in and play and unlock five-star uh, characters rather than just having to go and spend a whole bunch of money. But if you're good enough, you if you run through, if you defeat the raid boss, you can get a free five-star character. On top of that, um, it talks a little bit about the mana circle. There are some bonuses that you can get through the mana circle um, to like different resistances to different status effects, things like that. Um, another thing it talks about is if you, and I don't know if it specifically means like if you jump into a group with somebody else that's a friend of yours, or if you become friends with your character, but you can increase your overall use of certain abilities. Uh, and then the last two things I want to talk about before the end of this video is you do get free daily item summons and special uh, value packs you can buy as well to unlock heroes, items, worm prints, things like that. And then the last thing I want to talk about is the possibility of PvP. Now in this image right here, somebody talked about how translated it comes to Empire Battles it could be a hint at PvP, it could not be a hint at PvP. Because to be honest, it looks like those are specialized NPCs that you see on the screen. Uh, that night, it could be like special dungeons or special raids that you can run through, uh, special events, but it could be a hint at upcoming PvP features. We don't know. We're not entirely sure as of right now, but I thought I'd share that with you guys. I know this is more of a smaller video, but I wanted to share with you guys all that amazing uh, new content and information with you. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more Dragali Lost gameplay footage coming tomorrow. See you, my friends.